Hello everyone, this is Gary. Welcome to Objective-C for Absolute Beginners. Tonight we're going to be talking about um, Alice 3.0. When I wrote the second edition, um, Alice uh, 3 was in beta. And uh, middle of September, just a couple weeks ago, um, they released the final version of Alice and I wanted to go over some of the differences. So I'm going to go ahead and launch Alice now. And when Alice comes up, it's very similar to what we had before, except for it's more refined. Um, same screen here. Go ahead and select OK. And we have the same um, interface that we had with um, Alice 3 Beta. Um, what's different here is it's a little bit more refined. We have Setup uh, Scene instead of Edit Scene. So I'll go ahead and click on that. And this is where we go ahead and add our objects to the scene. Now, what's changed here is, again, a little bit uh, more refinement over here. Same ability to rotate your objects, etc. And down here, our classes are a little bit different. Um, so if we want to pick an object to add to our scene, we go ahead and pick one of these uh, classes. I'm going to go ahead and pick, I don't know, it really doesn't matter. I'll go ahead and pick the uh, falcon. Here. Now I can drag the falcon or I could click on it to add the object to my scene just like before. This is all identical before. Again, just a little bit different look and feel. And so I'm going to go ahead and select uh, the falcon. And now we can go ahead and rotate and translate. We have our little axis down here that we could change it. Uh, we can zoom in, move the camera in, move the camera out, turn the camera here a little uh, to the side, and then also rotate the camera up and down same as before so this is all pretty much identical with the exception of the classes down here have changed um, we have um, also the ability to add some um, graphic types here as well all right so i'm going to go ahead and go back to edit the code and from here on out it's pretty much everything's the same nothing much changed this is down here i believe before it was up here uh, but the previous version, it was down here. So it went from down here to up here, back to down here. Um, but anyway, so we can go ahead and drag, um, assuming we have our object here that we're working on. It's the Falcon. I have a few more objects, the scene and the ground and the camera. But we're working with this particular object. So you want to select it, make sure it's selected. And then we can drag and drop uh, what we want it to do. So I can say, let's just do our hello world here. Go ahead and click. That's for our font color, but this will say hello. We'll go ahead and change that to uh, now that's hello. There, go ahead and change that to hello world here. Hello world. And I'll go ahead and hit play to run this. And there it is. So um, you know, we can play with a little bit more here if we want to add some details. Duration, say we want to have it say it for two seconds so we can see it. Go ahead and play. Now it says hello world for two seconds and it's gone. But anything else should be pretty much identical. If you have any questions, feel free to shoot me an email or post it on the forum. Again, appreciate all your feedback and hopefully this is addresses any issues that you may have as you're starting to learn um, Alice 3.0. All right, thanks a lot. I appreciate it and have a great evening. Goodbye.